I'm going to show you now how to add assignments to your class. So you're going to click on the Classwork tab. And because I don't have any assignments yet, it makes it nice and easy for me. They give me this description here of what to do. I'm just going to click on this plus create and select assignment. Now I went to Teachers Pay Teachers and purchased a Google Slides assignment for elementary students. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to upload that today. I'm going to put in a title. Call this letter practice. Oops, practice. Helps if I spell it correctly. There we go. And my Google slide that I'm going to import has instructions on each of the slide, slide pages. So I'm just going to put some generic instructions here. Try your best. Now, one of the cool things about Google Classroom is it makes it really easy to differentiate. So you can see up here that I can select if I want to assign this to all students or if I wanted to just assign it to a particular set of students, I could do that as well. So if I had my students already in here, if they'd already joined my class, there would be a list of student names here and I could select who I wanted to assign it to. So maybe I just wanted Susie and Johnny to do that. I would find Susie and Johnny's name in this list and click their name and it would just assign it to them. Or I can assign it to everybody. So I'm going to assign this one to everybody. I'm going to scroll down here. I can put points on this assignment if I want. I can change it. Maybe I want this to be 10 points. Maybe I want it to be an ungraded assignment. If I'd like to put in a due date, I could do that. If I wanted to put in a topic, so maybe I wanted to differentiate between my math assignments and my language arts assignments, I could put a topic in here if I'd like to do that. And then I just need to find my assignment. So I saved the Teachers Pay Teacher item that I purchased into my Google Drive. So I'm going to click on the Drive symbol. And I'm going to find it here in my Google Drive. And I've worked on it recently, so it's nice and easy right up front there. So I clicked on that, and it's going to import it right here. Now, this is the thing that's really awesome about Google Classroom. So I purchased this Google Slides presentation. But what I want is for every kid to have a separate copy of the presentation. That way they can work on it and I can see their separate assignment. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click this little down arrow and I'm going to select make a copy for each student. This is really awesome because then it takes that Google slide presentation and copies a new version for every kiddo that opens it. That way they can work on it and have their own assignment. So I'm going to click assign. And Google Classroom is going to load this into my assignment stream, which is pretty awesome. It takes just a second here. And there it is. So when my students go in to click on the assignment, so they click on, oh, letter practice right there. They'd scroll down and they'd see, oh, here's the assignment Mrs. Schwartz gave me. And they'd click on it and it opens the Google slide presentation there. And because I selected to make a copy for each kid, they can manipulate this and it'll save their work so that I know how each student did on each portion of the presentation, which is really awesome.